When I think about a hard goal, at the beginning I don't know if I can do it or not. It's a big question mark. I never thought that I will uh, get to the top and free the whole line. Some people maybe think, why do you go back every year? I can't have enough from El Cap, it's such a special world. Yosemite is a really uh, special place for us. We feel small every time we walk to the wall. I know it's right to be here because when we are at the base, the same thing happens. Every time when we are here, it's never the same and always a big adventure. Life on the wall is incredible. It's not just climbing, it's all about the other stuff you have to do on the wall. It's about hauling, stashing food and water, and a lot of work is included. I need to clean the route. It's not the first beach I have to clean. It needs a lot of work, and I don't like it so much. Best conditions for climbing. For me, it's one of the best things in climbing, staying on the wall for days and having a simple life up there, staying totally focused, you don't have to think about anything else and this makes it so special. I don't have this in sport climbing or in other styles of climbing. You are really forced to live a really simple life. start to work on a project, most of the time I struggling from beginning on because I don't know the moves and everything feels super hard for me. I don't think about the last pitches, otherwise it would be totally frustrating for me. I just focus on the pitch I am working on at the moment. I don't expect that I will send it at the end. This is not the most important. For me, it's just like the big adventure to go there and to see what happened. It's not about the climbing itself. It's more like the time you spend together and the experience you have. The perfect moment is definitely this moment when you stand together up there on the summit and both did the route. It's something really special. That's geil, that's geil. 